Remember to click subscribe and notification button for more Abbas video. Cooking Appa. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. Today Appa is going to make uh, ikan tiga rasa. Yeah, it's a very um, commonly found Malay dish. Uh, ikan meaning fish, tiga rasa meaning three flavor. So it's going to be a fried fish and then uh, make a three so-called a three flavor sauce and pour over it. Yeah. So I have a very nice and very fresh uh, and very extremely meaty black prawn fruit with me today. Very very fresh. Okay. So this is probably about 500 gram, I think, and you can see from here, it is very very meaty. So what you want to do is after cleaning the fish, uh, you can actually uh, make two slits uh, on the on the uh, side of the fish and sprinkle it with a little bit of salt. So we are going to deep fry this fish later into super fragrant. Okay, Malay we call it. Uh, we will deep fry until it is very garing crispy. Then we will make the three flavor sauce, tikka rasa. So let's look at the ingredient here. Uh, I have some chopped uh, chili, red chili. This is about half a tomato here. This is approximately one quarter of big onion. And this is one stalk of spring onion. And one tablespoon of chopped ginger and one tablespoon of chopped garlic here. And I have some fresh coriander for garnishing later. You can also put in um, cucumber. I don't have cucumber today, right? So uh, then you will need to make the sauce. Well, basically the sauce will be made out of um, uh, tomato sauce, oyster sauce, dark soy sauce, light soy sauce, and I will be putting in a little bit of fish sauce as well. And of course, salt and sugar. Recently, I've been testing a new oil recommended by my followers. Uh, this one, the rice, never mind the brand, but rice brand oil. This oil so far, it is almost uh, considered the best uh, oil I have used so far. Yeah. Uh, why is it the best? Well, basically, mainly because it can really sustain a uh, high heat a long time. And the smoking point for this um, this oil is super high, which is even go up when above 200 degrees Celsius. So what is this telling you? Um, every time when we want to uh, fry fish, you want your oil as hot as possible. So, and we always say smoking hot. So this one, this oil, if you use this oil to deep fry your fish, it's going to be super beautiful. Outside super crispy, inside is still very tender. Uh, I tried a few times, fantastic. Only issue is expensive. <laughs> it is a very expensive oil to use for deep frying. But sometimes I will use it, uh, I will recycle it. Depending how clean the oil uh, end up to be. Alright, so I'm going to uh, go on a medium high heat and, and let, it, uh, let the temperature raise above 180 degrees. Then only I will put in the fish. Right, the moment you start to see some smoke coming up, that is the kind of temperature we wanted. Get a long spatula to help you safe, uh, safely put in the fish. So after you put in the fish, don't try to flip it so open. You will leave it there, this side, for at least about two to three minutes before you flip over to the other side, okay? So, um, we will come back later, yeah, shortly. Meanwhile, actually, you can also, if you like, you can do a bit like this, but I don't bother. <laughs> okay, we will come back shortly. So this is after about three minutes. I think it will be easier for you to flip over if you use another spoon to help you push your fish to the side and flip it over, yeah? I'm still using medium high heat right now. You can see we are getting some really nice golden brown color for the black pond already. And it is super fragrant. Actually, 
uh, the tail, the fin, all this is going to be super fragrant as well. So I'm going to give this side another about 3 minutes and then it is basically done. Not difficult at all. Right, this is after another 3 minutes. This part is because there's no oil here, therefore it will stick, yeah? So in the restaurant, usually they put in a lot of oil. So that's even harder to stick. But at home, usually we don't put so, as much oil. Ooh. Ooh, this side is super, super fragrant. You can see from the color, my goodness. Okay, so it's basically done. Push it to the side. Get ready an oil absorbing paper at the side of kitchen tower, okay? On a plate and put it over. Let's very quickly make the sauce. I'm going to give it some oil. Number two to three tablespoons to start with. And we want to saute our ginger and garlic. Next thing I'm going to put is the tomato sauce, about 3 to 4 tablespoons. Yeah, I got, I got uh. Why is it we want to saute the tomato sauce? Because when tomato sauce uh, get um, contact with oil, it can then release the color even better. Like what you are seeing right now. Uh, don't use too high heat. Tune down the fire a bit. Now I'm going to put in about one tablespoon of oyster sauce. About one tablespoon of light soya sauce. A bit of fish sauce. Dark soya sauce a little bit. Some water. Now you can raise the heat. Let me wash my hand. And let's put in a bit of salt. And some sugar. If you prefer reddish, more reddish color, put you can put lesser uh, dark, uh, dark soya sauce. Yeah. So um, let's give it some uh, starch solution to thicken out the sauce. You can see the orangey oil yeah, carving up. That is the kind of effect that we wanted. Right, now I'm going to off the fire and put in the star solution. So immediately it will be uh, the sauce will be taken up.
Mmm, super fragrant. Okay, I'm going to pour this over to the fish. You can give it a bit of white pepper if you like. Okay, I've put it, put the fish onto a serving plate. And then let's pour over the sauce. Like I mentioned, if you prefer it reddish in color, then you don't have to put even uh, dark soya sauce, okay? Maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> okay, and then we uh, give some fresh coriander on top to garnish. Then it's done. Okay, so I hope you like my video. Here's my uh, ikan tiga rasa. Uh, uh, if you like my video, do share my video out on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking Up Facebook fan page to click like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Up YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Bye bye.